Belanger inbounds to Gaston, right hand corner, brings it back out. Now it comes down low to Kilpatrick, double team there, gets it underneath on a great feed over to Frankenberger by Eliza Simpson. It came to Simpson, kind of a no look pass to Frankenberger for the easy deuce. Amber uh, Mixon, Mixon comes up on going coast to coast, and then almost lost it, she did. Two on one break, Gaston to the hole, Gaston all the way, layup, good. Down low to Spoto, she's there for the layup, puts this one in from the left side. Now Andy Norman gambled on the wrong shoulder, the lob pass was a perfect lead, and Spoto gives New Hampshire 14 points, and all 14 points have been in the paint. Mixon, out front to Zabo, left side in the corner, and it's Toskovic on the drive, back out to a foul line jumper. That is up and bouncing around three times and going in for Andy Norman, the freshman from out of Ohio. Nothing wrong with trying to bring it inside if it's there. She forced that last pass, though. Cats were fortunate not to turn it over. Simpson. Down low to Kilpatrick. She's baseline, makes a nice move to the hole, gets it out to Gaston from 12 feet. No good out the back of the iron. Frankenberger the rebound. Over to Gaston for the layup. A big board in traffic. Three people on her, and she still found the assist to Gaston for the layout. And they'll bring it out to Mixon and they'll set up the offense. Mixon over to the other side to the right, another three ball by for a check and she puts this one in. All right, it is Gaston right of the circle, out to Belanche, eight seconds, Elizabeth on the drive, runner is up, it's good, and it will count, and she is gonna go to the stripe for one, went right at Tia Dawson. The front down low, it comes to Kilpatrick, double team on her, got it back over to Simpson, still time on the clock. 10 seconds on the play clock. Gaston will start it out 30 feet away. Comes to the right of the lane. Tricky dribbles over to uh, Frankenberger. Frankenberger to Kilpatrick. Lays it in with one second on the clock. Back out front. He'll bring it around the circle to the right side. Over to Simpson. Simpson to the circle. Out of Belanger. Baseline right in the corner. Elizabeth driving. Elizabeth spins. Pies it up. It goes in on two bounces. What a great spin move though in traffic. Good man to man. Basketball comes over to Gaston. Gaston got a three-on-one break. Leaves it underneath for Belanger, lays it up and in. The foul line out to Kilpatrick. She had Gaston for a moment. Now she gets it to Gaston. Brings it out to eight seconds. Ariel comes to the right of the circle underneath to Kilpatrick. One dribble in traffic, lays it in in traffic. The ball, Gaston. Down low to Kilpatrick, brings it back out front. In the left hand corner ends up in the hands of Gaston comes to the hole for the layup made a good first step and went right to the basket for the easy layup down to eight seconds not much else happening here except Rowan is uh, going to put on a little dribble and we're down to two and one and this one is over so the Wildcats will come up with its sixth win of the season in pretty impression, impressive passion it wasn't perfect by a long shot but uh, nonetheless, they did what they had to do against a team that has five wins to its credit. But unfortunately, Padarmouth just hasn't been able to find any scoring touch throughout the year.